Now, the Gatwick Airport has resumed operations after remaining under a lockdown for over 32 hours. The China Eastern Airlines flight from Shanghai is just landed into Gatwick. This is the first international flight to land at the airport since the airport was shut due to drone scare. And Gatwick is one of the busiest airports in the United Kingdom. Thousands of passengers had been stranded at Gatwick Airport in the holiday season. Authorities say the drones were flown as part of a planned act to shut down the airport. Incoming flights were asked to land in Heathrow, Luton and Manchester. Some of the flights were diverted as far as Paris and Amsterdam instead. Earlier, UK Prime Minister Theresa May said that strict action would be taken against those found guilty. May I first of all say I feel for all those passengers who've, whose travel uh, plans have been disrupted by this drone activity and the action that's had to be taken in response to it. And obviously at this particular time of year, this is particularly difficult for people. We've already uh, passed legislation in relation to the use of drones, so it is now, as has been made clear, the activity we've seen is illegal and those who are caught um, endangering aircraft can face up to five years in, uh, in prison. Uh, and that's legislation that we've already introduced and actually we're concerned Consulting on further aspects of this, including further police powers, but we will continue to work with the Gatwick authorities, and the police will be working with the Gatwick authorities in order to bring this to uh, to a close, such that people can actually be will be able to get on and uh, to the travel that they were expecting over the Christmas period.